I grew up, I went upstate to Oswego to college for a couple of years, and I didn't feel quite right there. And I came to Queens, and it was all of a sudden I knew who I was. Why do you think that was? I realized that this attitude and these people are what are, are the soil of my personality. And I have, to, I have to be here, I have to stay here, and then I'll become who I'm supposed to be. In this video, we're looking at the NITI INFJ Sleep Consume Blast Play. They are concept-based, introverted decision makers. Unlike the NIFI, they're making decisions on what works for them. Not necessarily what they like, but what works. They are powered by a processed information telling. The NITI is a jumper type in that they jump their FE to prefer to use their TI. And so they're using introverted intuition and then jumping extroverted feeling and then doubling down on their introverted self and going to introverted thinking. And this type is going to prize order over chaos and they're going to be making decisions primarily based on what works for them. So that makes them a self over tribe. And so they will be considered a quadruple introvert in both their functions and their energy and information animals. So they're asking the question, does this concept, in Jerry Seinfeld's case, comedy routine, does this concept work for me? Do I, do I like it? Do, do, do I think it's funny? And if it works, can I bring it into the real world for people to enjoy? We see Seinfeld doing this all the time. He writes his very precise comedy. It seems to work for him. Then it, if he takes it into the outside world, and if people laugh, then he knows it works, which was what part of what makes Jerry Seinfeld extremely funny. When it comes to their energy levels, this type prefers to process over being into the world and playing into the world. And Seinfeld would be processing his jokes, his routines uh, throughout the day and really working on it. And they are consume over blast, which means he's not going to just ad lib a comedy scene. He's going to really know it. He's going to really have it down pat. And so we see him preserving energy, but we also see him processing and consuming information and then finally blasting it in kind of a nerd kind of talk way. Uh, you don't get a lot of the NT in Seinfeld's comedy routine, but when you watch the interview, uh, you see him talking a little bit in that way. And then if he has leftover energy, he'll do whatever. But that's definitely last in the stack for this type. This type strengths, uh, very good at figuring out the concepts. Uh, there's a reason that Jerry Seinfeld is one of the most famous comedians, why his show Seinfeld was so hilarious. He figured out what was funny and what people thought was funny. And so he figures that out. And so they're very good, very good at figuring out a concept. A, 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 the, the Seinfeld show was about nothing, essentially. That was the NI concept of it. And it just continued to make people laugh year in and year out. And he knows what works for him. Uh, that's the TI. He knows what process works for him. And uh, he's even said that he will not go on comedy shows. No Zoom comedy. He'll go on comedy shows when it, it's back to what it used to be, back what it is without uh, COVID. He's not going to uh, explore a, a random new way of doing things. So that's a strength. Um, he'll think through major decisions, which you've already touched on a little bit. I've already touched on, and he will complete a project. This type will complete projects. They will not turn in work. They will not complete projects or turn in projects that aren't finished. So that's a strength. Now let's look at the weaknesses. The weaknesses are, is that they will not naturally consider what others like what works for them because they're trying to find what, work, what works for themselves. Now, Seinfeld does understand, for instance, using him as an example, that if people do not laugh at your jokes, it isn't funny. And so he will fine tune his concept and he'll like it, but then the people have to laugh. And so he has really made his fame off of that. They will struggle with introducing concepts into their reality sometimes, and uh, that can be a weakness. And they will not have a lot of energy to burn, a lot of excess energy to burn. Uh, if you watch some of his interviews, you can tell that um, he says what he wants to say, and then he kind of just doesn't say much more. And, 
And when they're starting something new, they can take a long time to get moving, take a long time to change direction. That's part of the sleep consume animal. So the path to growth for this type is to do things that they don't want to do. Get out of their planning mode. Allow chaos to enter their life more often. Um, for someone like Seinfeld, it would be to take a risk, to do a comedy routine maybe without going through his process. That would be very frightening for him. Uh, very scary, but he would maybe learn to trust another function like extrovert sensing. Maybe he would get laughs he never thought he'd get. And so that is a path to growth. Before making a decision, this type could maybe ask a couple people if what they're doing is likable. If you're working on a project at work, ask a coworker, hey, would you, would you like this? Is this something that the office would like? I mean, it might work for me, but don't put all the work into something if people are not going to like it or if they're going to hate it. Also, give yourself time limits for making decisions. Uh, make some without doing much research. And then one day to get that play energy worked on, uh, just carve out a whole day and just ask someone special in your life, hey, we're going to go and do anything you want to do. And that can be a way to really gl grow that play energy. One thing I got distinctly from Seinfeld, he's one of these people, you, you do things right. I don't think he wants to cut corners. I don't think he wants to do a, a Zoom comedy show. And if that means having to wait six months, a year from now, he's prepared to do that. <laughs>